Howdy, folks. Live from Big Top Chautauqua, welcome to another episode of Tent Show Radio. Funding support for Tent Show Radio is brought to you by the Bayfield Inn. Stay, dine, and relax year-round on the shoreline of Lake Superior in downtown Bayfield. Any traveler, any season, any meal, your view awaits. More info at thebayfieldinn.com. And we're brought to you by the Bayfield Chamber of Commerce, beautiful Bayfield and the Apostle Islands. You can tour sea caves and shop our galleries and stores on the shore of Lake Superior. Information and lodging at bayfield.org. And now, here's your host of Tent Show Radio, best-selling author, humorist, and singer-songwriter, Michael Perry. Howdy, folks, and welcome to Tent Show Radio from Lake Superior Big Top, Chautauqua. Tonight, we feature a look back at two Big Top performances, one from 2006 by Nickel Creek and another from 2009 by the Punch Brothers. And then, at intermission, from the much more recent past, I'll tell a story that happened just last week. There will be some yelling. Folks, the music you're about to hear emanates from a special space in a special place. The Big Top is just that, a grand blue and pearl gray striped canvas beauty suitable for a circus, but in this case, home to a history of live performance centered on the stage. The Big Top seats are set directly on the earth, and what a spot of earth it is, high atop a hill overlooking beautiful Bayfield, Wisconsin, Lake Superior, and those all-natural waterbound wonders, the Apostle Islands. If you enjoy that vision, if you enjoy what you hear over the course of the next hour, and you want to see and experience it firsthand, please get to know us at www.bigtop.org. It sounds beautiful up here because it is beautiful up here. You ought to come on up. Our first act this evening began playing together in public before any of the trio were teens. Their first show was at a pizza palace. By the time they played the big blue tent here, they were full-grown adults who had toured the world and won a Grammy. Known for music of delicacy and beauty and flash musicianship, their sound is sweetly suited for an evening in a tent such as this. And just when you're floating on all that sweetness, they grab another gear and put you on the bluegrass train. We loved it then, we love it now. Hear now the music of Nickel Creek. Early and dawn 
Thank you very much. Stays at home Saying no one knows So I don't, honey When in Rome
Russian with an answer Only dead men know But I'm gonna bet they never really feel at home If they spent their lifetimes learning how to live in Rome Beautiful, beautiful tonight, isn't it? A lovely evening. It's been too hot recently. I don't know if it's been too hot here recently, but everywhere else we've been, it's been too hot. Uh, I actually live in New York. I was there before the last two shows that we did. And that is actually sweltering. It's nice to be here. I went running out through the, uh, the cross-country skiing trails. Anybody ever do that when there's snow? Beautiful. Killer ferns, though. <laughs> Very strange. They, the first they... three songs that we did are all off our new record, Why Should the Fire Die? We actually started with the title track. The second song was called Scotch and Chocolate, uh, which should be enjoyed in moderation nightly. The third <laughs> song was called When in Rome. And we're now going to go to our eponymous debut CD and a song off of that written by an Irish woman named Sinead Lowen. The song is called Out of the Woods. I wish you out of the woods And into a picture with me
Thank you. I went for a little walk today. <laughs> um, I was <laughs> just like tuning me, and I was looking down at my feet, and I still have sand on my feet from wading in the lake. Uh, and I was talking with my friend uh, Timothy a lot. We were, we were having all kinds of wonderful discussions, um, some of which might have dabbled in the the side of relationships, may or may not. Have, I don't really know. And uh, so, so this is this is for Timothy. Sounds that show no pain I can't hear 
Can't decide between between the fourth movement of the D minor or the second movement of the A minor. Anybody got A minor. the A minor? A minor? Though it's unrehearsed. All right, and it's much longer. Okay, uh, this is this is. Um, I think it's not too crazy to do this. I think I got it. We'll see. If I don't, I'll. Uh, I'll launch into the other one. <laughs> then you'll notice a dramatic shift to the minor four all of a sudden. <laughs> That's not Bach. He's perfect. I am but a man. <laughs> so without further ado, the, the fugue from the A minor sonata written for solo violin by Johann Sebastian Bach.
You are listening to Tent Show Radio. Welcome to Intermission, folks. Last week, I received a mysterious call from a friend. His voice was animated but distant, as if he was hollering from inside a barrel, possibly while rolling around in the back of a truck. Mike? Mike? Can you hear me? I kept saying his name and saying I could hear him, but he clearly couldn't hear me. There followed silence and what sounded like more clunking. Then I heard his voice again, still muffled, and as if from a distance. Now he was yelling, Hey Siri! Hey Siri! Hey Siri! Then we disconnected. I'm generally slow to alarm, but I was immediately uneasy. I knew this particular friend was on a three-day solo drive through a remote part of the West. He's also a tech whiz with a calm demeanor. Not the sort of fellow to go around helplessly yelling at his handset. I wondered if he was lying injured some distance from his phone, or if he had been abducted. I dialed him twice, and both calls went straight through to voicemail. So I sent him two texts and an email, pasting the same message into each in the hopes one might get through. Got phone call from you, then disconnected and heard you talking to Siri, just checking you're okay. Just then, I got a text from an unfamiliar number. Yo, this is me. He used his name. I won't. Ah, good, I texted with relief. He replied, Do you still have my car app? Well over a year ago, I borrowed this friend's vehicle. It's one of those new cars that comes with its own app, and I had downloaded it to my phone. I checked, and sure enough, buried several screens deep beside the Yahtzee. There it was. I confirmed, and he texted back, Can you log in and unlock my car? And so it was, from a distance of 2,102 miles and three time zones, I tapped my phone, and shortly thereafter received a text from what was now obviously a phone he'd borrowed from a stranger. He's in. Dude, I texted back, I feel like we just landed on Mars. It's a shining moment in human progress, he replied. Then, holy cow, that was a cluster bleep. Car key, phone, and Apple Watch, all locked in the car. He thanked me then, and we both prepared to go about our day. But then I got to thinking, and I texted him again. Wait a minute. Were you yelling at Siri through the window? Like a madman, he replied. As of this moment, he is safely back home, but we have yet to speak in person. I have exceptionally high hopes for the reenactment. I also have exceptionally high hopes for our next act. The common thread is Chris Thiele, joined in this case by a number of other fleet-fingered folks. The common thread also is bluegrass, although when discussing the formation of this band, Thiele described it as aesthetically a bluegrass band, which implies there's some wiggle room. And indeed, you'll hear that as this show unfolds. Here they come, hot as a downtown Bayfield fish boil on a summer evening and as cool as the blue waters of Lake Superior. Ladies and gentlemen, here are the Punch Brothers. Been a good summer up here, huh?
Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it's nice under the big top.
fit, nobody's perfect Gray hair ain't a crown of wisdom You'll be a young man until you're an old man She say, hey, you look a lot like someone I like to Look just far enough under the sun To never come
Funding support for Tent Show Radio is provided by the Bayfield Inn. With 21 hotel rooms, over 25 vacation rentals, a lounge, on-site restaurant, and rooftop bar, there's something for you at the Bayfield Inn. More info at thebayfieldinn.com. And we're brought to you by Bayfield County Tourism. Find out how to get in touch with your inner wild at travelbayfieldcounty.com. And by the Ashland Chamber of Commerce. Ashland, Wisconsin has year-round fishing on Shawamigan Bay. For a free fishing brochure, visit ashland.com. Punch Brothers, Nickel Creek, and through it all, Chris Thiele. Just one more reminder of all the otherworldly music floating around this joint. Well, folks, that is our show for tonight. Whether you beam it or stream it, we thank you for listening. We're as grateful as a guy who found his friend's keys on his phone. We'd love it if you come on up Bayfield Way or down or over or through for a live show one day. Details always available at bigtop.org. You can visit me anytime at sneezingcow.com. Until next we share the air, remember, where I come from and here at Tent Show Radio, nobody ever says goodbye. They just say, well, I suppose...